What's going on everyone? It's Vispa and today we know by the top of the video what's going on. We're gonna try and attempt to get Man United relegated in the Premier League by selling all the players for whatever price possible. You guys can enjoy this because I'm a United fan and I don't want my team to get ready. So yeah, that's why. So hope you guys enjoy it. Like and subscribe. Yeah, please introduce the manager. The king has returned. He has successfully returned. We do not care about all this. So let what what should we start off with first, man? Where do we start off first? First of all, let's get rid of the glazers. If we can do that. Heaton is our main goalkeeper, first of all. Casemiro. Oh, this is so painful. Everyone it has to go blood. Especially this guy. This guy. Oh my god. I don't know what's worse. Him or no goalkeeper. Honestly. Action has to go. Mount. Why did we even sign you? Sancho. Oh, even worse. Oh, my favorite player, bro. Spider-Man. Ha! Oh, even. Oh, the legend himself. Harry Maguire. You know, we're going to keep him for this. McTommy. Bloody fidget spinner over here. It's probably going to be for free. Tony Marshall. Oh, bro. You know what? I have to sell him, though. That's the thing. Like, like in the other challenge, we lose all the top players. Like, he's not even... Oh, like there's no like oh Hoyland, my brother i thought he will be the miracle we needed today we got greenwood still who has to return find the beak <laughs> evans garnacho should we now nah, we have to we have to sell him the rest of these guys will be playing menu will be getting full games so everyone um the only player i'm keeping is probably maguire just for memes and if, oh, here we go. Objectives. So, domestic success. Finish in UEFA Champions League spot. And within the remaining two seasons, win the Premier League title. Oh my god. Okay. That is not looking for. But yeah, if you guys don't know the rules. I have to sign three players born in Asia. Bro, I'm signing flipping Indian players then. That's one of the... So yeah, but the rules, if you guys do not know, is that we have to get the team relegated. That's the whole point. And once we get the team relegated, it's completed. It's it's basically um, successful. Uh, I don't know, debuild? I don't know what you call it. But yeah, um, but while doing that we have to try our best not to get sacked basically so we have to try not to get sacked and that's the whole well thing where's sunil chetri bro i want to sign sunil chetri man but there's this legend the goat himself all right and we also want to sign a few other old united players whoever is still playing is Nanny so I'm sure Nanny is so bad. Yeah, there's he 36 years old. Oh, he's retiring. Shit, okay. Who else is playing small and nice too good though? Yeah, there's only there's no good players left now. To Roma for 32 million pounds. And oh McTominay leaves to a Chelsea, I I think. Yes, for 17 million. Probably I'll be our only, our second most expensive transfer this season. Victor Lundelof as well left for 14 million to Spurs. The clean out is happening slowly. Sell them. Um, we won't we won't do the friendlies because our morality, it, it can change the team and they can, the green on the top left could probably change too red or something so we're not gonna play any um friendly so we just sold um some players there garnacho van der Beek as well getting okay next player to get sold is rafael varan to atletico madrid why is that guy in a kit bro 
What does G stand for? Is, he, is, is our team doing so bad that he has to play now? Is that what's going on? <laughs> Bro is in a kit. He's ready to play the assistant manager. He is taking Varan's position in the center back role. Oh my word. Okay. That's insane. So 36.9 million. Tony Marshall. And again, our assistant manager is still with a kit. Showing off that he is playing, bro. That he's going to take his position. He's an all-rounder player, basically. Our assistant manager. Insane. He's still doing that. So, Tony Marshall out to Brentford for £16.5 million. Pounds. Who is leaving? And it is Sancho on his way to Wolves. And again, our assistant manager is still in a kit, man. What is going on with FIFA? Or EAFC? Or FC20? I don't even know what you call this game no more, man. Is it FC24 or is it EAFC24? We got best defender, bro. This guy put Mbappe in his pocket, my guy. For two years, but I want you for five years. Bro, is Fellaini still in this game? <laughs> has to be, right? I just thought about it now. Fellaini has to be, yeah. Uh, well, we'll give you not. Know, we'll give you hundred thousand pounds, Dan Burn, every week. He 90 million for Marwan Fellaini, our most expensive signing. This guy is still in a kit. Even the receptionist is in a kit. What is going on? And Marwan Fellaini has returned to Old Trafford, ladies and gentlemen. One of the best signings I probably will ever make in this series. All right, this is probably the best thing. Number nine as well, he gets. Oh, he looks amazing in this kit, man. Maruan Fellaini. Legend. I don't know, from Shangdong Tashan for 90 million pounds. That was amazing. And these two are still in the kit, bro. Welcome back, Ashley Young, to Manchester United for Aaron Van Bissaka. We'll take that. This is, this is like so. This is deep down, this is so, but content is content you know what i mean i'm tripping okay these guys are really tripping so we signed danny Wolbach for 7.4 million pounds let's see now 17.8 million henrik mkhitaryan signs i don't know we're not gonna get lukaku because he's still very good like in the game yeah man cristiano ronaldo is back <laughs> <laughs> i can't believe it i can't believe we done it <laughs> I thought it wouldn't be possible. Look at this. Look at this. 18 million. Him, Maron Fellaini up front. And there's another player. I can't remember who it was. But yeah, Cristiano Ronaldo for 80 million. Dan Byrne has signed for Manchester United officially now. Who would it be like? Oh, Van Bies Oh, no. Tyrell Marassia for Dan Burns. Me him back to Manchester United. Nemanja Matic. Him and Fellaini in the midfield. Insane. Is there? Okay then. 89,000 a week for Herrera. That's insane. Assistant manager. This guy is just like me. The assistant manager, that is. For Manchester United. For 9 million pounds, we'll take that. I don't know what's going on there. 2.8 million, we sign on Ramsey get in so we've got a few more players left and then we will sign them we need to sign carriers we don't have a choice we have to sign carriers just the first asian player or like indian asian i don't know what i'm saying but first indian player for manchester united let's go and behind that is soon hail but who is on his way to join you i thought he signed there but he's on his way who else is leaving and that's rashford who leaves to liverpool he didn't reject he just kicked down for 50 million we'll take that though amount of money we'll take that amount of money fernandez has got an offer for 88 million which we will accept remember we're just accepting so we can just get the deals done quickly as possible oh and next up is casemiro for 40 million to brighton we will take that we will take that's a good deal right there, man. 
50,000, 97,000, insane. Okay, and here we go. The last two, well, uh, the, the, one of the signs of our goalkeeper is not our last two. His glorious carriers, 1.3 million from Newcastle United. Amazing. And also, Matteo Damian, 80 overall. He'll definitely strengthen the back with Harry Maguire in the defense. So, yeah. So this is the team and how it's looking after the transfers that we have done. I'm not going to bring anyone else in. This is going to be the team for the rest of the season. These are the only two players left to sell. We got Ramsey here as well. Um, put him on the bench. So yeah, uh, and um, this guy. So three of these guys are left to sell. We need to sell them as soon as possible. And we are sorted. We got to I'm gonna take my brother, release him, release him, and uh, last but not least, release. And with that out of the way, it's time to get into the simulation, ladies and gentlemen. So we are going to simulate till January, and we're gonna come back to see if we have a job or not. So yeah, let's get into it for you guys will be like right now you'll be into january like in three two one ladies and gentlemen it is january and and i don't know man look at the scout it changed everything every play like it was good players and now it's players we don't even know man it literally changed but before we get into that results i want to see what the team Okay, sitting at four stars, okay? But look at the teams. Like, the players are going down. Okay? So, I don't know, man. I hope... I hope... What, where are we right now? So, this is the FA Cup in the round round three of the FA Cup. Uh, let's look at the Carabao Cup. Where are we in the Carabao Cup? So, we made it to round four. We lost to Spurs. Okay. Now... The moment of truth, Premier League. We are 17th on the log. Oh my word. Okay. Okay, so we we close. We are close to getting relegated. I, I think we are definitely going to get relegated. And Spurs again is first. They keep winning the league. Even in the last game. I don't, in the last, not the last game, but the last video you saw we did with Liverpool. Spurs and Sheffield kept the same spot. Spurs and Sheffield kept the same position, should I say. Both first and both... One's first, one is 20th, so... All that's left to do is do another simulation. Um, but before we do that, let's look at the squad hub and see how many goals and stats that we're looking at. So Ronaldo with 8 goals, 6 assists. Insane, insane. Uh, Mkhitaryan with 5 goals and 6 and 1 assist. Diallo with 4 goals, 1 assist. Ashley Young with 2 goals. Myron Fellaini with one goal, Blint with one goal and two assists. So Ronaldo is carrying us at the moment. And let's see how our goalkeeper Karius is doing. So, two clean sheets only in 20 games. Yes, that's insane. Alright, so it's up to simulation day. If we can keep our job till May, that will be insane if we can. If not, I'm, I'm not expecting to keep the job, but if we do, what is what on earth is going on this would be the most successful build so yeah i'll see you guys at the end of the tunnel okay so a month a month after january we get sacked straight after january it took them really long but we got sacked a month after january and we are still obviously gonna simulate and we are now got luton town we have arrived at the end of the season and one thing's left is to see newcastle won the league whoa that's insane and united survive <laughs> what on earth man united survive relegation i have failed but i have succeeded at the oh my god look at that title race 85 82 85 86 87 but what? How did United not get relegated? Actually, that's like my concern here. Yeah. Because I like, I told you guys, Ronaldo, Ronaldo saved them. 
let's see the stats of Ronaldo here. Okay, so he's he didn't score 10 plus goals here, it looks like. Because he ain't here. But since Ronaldo's day was seven assists though in the league. Let's go to team stats. Okay, we have failed, guys, because we didn't get United Ronaldo United relegated. The United okay, he stayed with the same goals. Diallo coming up with the most assists. He's went up. So he went up. Ronaldo went down. Wildback went down. They definitely getting relegated next season, though. They are definitely getting relegated next season. That's a confirmed hit there. Because I don't see them surviving next season. If we go and look at team sheets, right? I guarantee you Luton Town. Oh my god, look at that. 73, 71, 75, right? Let's compare that to... Oh, okay, yeah. Bro, Luton, are you that bad, bro? This is... Is Luton that bad? I'm sorry, Luton fans, but like... This team is already better than United. How did you get relegated? This team is better than United. Look at this team! Look at this team! It's so good! How did United not get relegated? Um, you know what I think we should do? Let's let's see if United is gonna offer us. Oh my God, they can offer. We can get a job. We can go back to Man United. <laughs> Imagine we return to Man United. That would be insane. Oh no, <laughs> we are not interested in the vacant. In you are not interested in the vacant manager position with our club. We've taken careful note of your CV reference, but I'm we were looking at the alternative candidates to fill the role. That is so nice of them. <laughs> but yeah, um, guys, this is the end of the video so yeah if you guys do enjoy it dude uh comment down below and like and subscribe i'm a united fan and i'm gonna just tell you guys right now i did not want united to get relegated okay that's all that's why i signed the cristiano ronaldo that's why i signed him if i didn't sign him we ever got relegated that's actual pure fact actually i'm not gonna lie i mean we got the most wins until 16 place so yeah but yet again a win is a win screw you liverpool fans you guys thought we gonna lose but we did not we always win united united united